Can you all guess what time it is? That's right! Species quest time! <sighs> Find the water below. Well, that really depends on what you mean by that. If you mean like a water pillow like a water bed, then that's acceptable, but if they actually mean a pillow made out of water, that'd be pretty impossible. Then again, I guess I shouldn't be expecting realism from a g game about mythical creatures in a digital world, but still. So, uh, it's basically, it's the exact same as the Iron Pillow quest, just the item you're looking for is called Water Pillow. You even have to go to the same area and fight the same Digimon. And it's not like the Digimon are any different from dawn or dusk in the sunken tunnel, there's in training and lower level rookies. Stop chewing on that. I was talking to my cat. If anyone out there is chewing on anything, feel free to continue. <laughs> Stop it. Cat again. He doesn't like to listen very much, but... What can you do? He's a cat. So yeah, like I said, it's basically the same thing, just with Iron Pillow replaced with Water Pillow, or vice versa if you played Dawn first. And it's not like he's that hard of a boss. He's much more willing to work along with you if you beat him up first. So it's time to return the water pillow to Betamon and start the next species quest. I am really not do looking forward to doing some of the later areas again. Just because I hate the, ma the maze-like structure of most of them. So it's time for the next species quest, which I'm going to do 
stop the diggers in Login Mountain. It's a different Digimon in Dawn and Dusk, but it's basically the same quest, just again with different Digimon. It was either that or have to basically open up loops, I mean, sunken tunnel, all up just to get the Digi Deli cake or save Shellmon in Loop Swamp. Ugh. Why is Renamon telling me what to do? Why should I even listen? Stupid bad role models. And besides, how do they always know that the place is going to collapse? I mean... Uh... It's not like it can really tell how stable the mountain is or isn't. I don't think uh, any Digimon would be qualified to make a statement on that, but... Again, that's just me. I should really stop trying to multitask while because I am playing my DS once again. But most of the stuff you've seen once before, so again, there's not much that needs to be said. It's not like there is going to be a giant parade randomly in the middle of nowhere. I know you had your heart sent on, set on something different happening, but the game's basically the same except for at a few points. I've noticed this, but I seem to use the camera a lot more at Login Mountain. I don't know why. Just your random fun fact for the day. So they never really, uh, explain why these Digimon have to specifically dig in Login Mountain. And I'm, uh, certain that 
I'm uh, certain that there's got to be at least one spot in Logan Mountain that's safe to dig. It can't be all unstable rubble all the, everywhere. It's like a lot of these places are intact for after being hit by an earthquake, but... I'm probably just being a fool bringing logic into this situation, but... You know, that's just me. 